It's no surprise that coastal neighborhoods come at a premium. Who wouldn't want to live by the beach? And in San Clemente, there's several neighborhoods that come with a hefty price tag. What makes those homes so special? Are they even worth the cost? On today's video, we're gonna look at the most expensive home communities in San Clemente. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, I'm Ryan Schramm. I'm the real estate broker and owner of Ryan Schramm Real Estate here in San Clemente. Thanks so much for watching. All right, let's get back into it. So what are the most expensive home communities in San Clemente? Number three, anything on the coastal bluff. This is kind of a neighborhood that I'm making up right here on the fly because there are different bluffs in different neighborhoods. But if you look at any of the coastal bluff, this means this property is scooted out right onto the edge of the cliff. When you're looking down, you see the sand, you see the white water. Anything on the bluff is gonna come with a hefty price tag. So when you're looking at the types of bluff front properties, you've got anything from little cottages, like say around 1,900, 2,000 square feet, up to some pretty spectacular properties. Let's say the largest bluff property in San Clemente is right around 8,000 square feet and that house recently traded for right around $8 million. Number two, Cypress Shores. Cypress Shores is a private, guard-gated community pushed right out onto the edge of San Clemente's pretty much southernmost beach. It's a super cool community. The homes in here come with a really hefty price tag. You've got larger custom homes for the most part. The smaller homes, you know, around 3,300 square feet, to anything up, you know, pushing six, 7,000 square feet and one really nice compound in the shores, for instance, that was on an acre parcel that recently traded for right around $10 million. So you've got a mix of property trading from anywhere between 3.3 million up to $10 million in the shores. And is it worth it? You'd have to tell me, you come in down a very historic motorcade entryway, you're looking at the ocean, you pull through a gate, there's a private park with koi ponds and it, it really feels Hawaiian-esque when you walk through this. And then you've got a key fob, you swipe it right in through Northgate and onto a private beach. I would say if you've got the money, it's absolutely worth it. And number one, the gate within the gate, Cotton Point Estates. So what I mean by the gate within the gate is you have to pull through the Cypress Shores gate and then drive through the Cypress Shores community and into another private gate where the, all the homes are built on acre parcels, some of them even more land than that. In fact, the Western White House, Richard Nixon had a property in San Clemente when he was president and it got named the Western White House for obvious reasons. That property has almost a football field worth of frontage right on a little coastal bluff looking out over Cotton Point and the amazing surf and beach that is down below it. So the Cotton Point Estates are definitely the most expensive homes that we have here in San Clemente. Prices for these properties right now range from anywhere between 10 and $12 million. And a residence right next to the Western White House recently traded for, I think it was $36 million. That was a spectacular property. And the Western White House has been on and off the market in recent years, and the price tag for that is right around $50 million. So you can see very steep prices in the Cotton Point Estates, but some very historical, significant property and spectacular all at the same time. So there you have it. Those are the most expensive communities in San Clemente. What'd you think? Drop me a comment below, let me know. San Clemente has so many different communities to offer, whether it's an expensive community or even the uh, most affordable communities, which I recently did a video on, if you wanna check the link to that video here. If there's something you would specifically like me to cover or you think I left out your community, let me know, I'd love to hear from you. Thanks so much and take care.